Alrighty then, so welcome back once again to Tales of Zestiria, and we have a Medusa thing to take out. Not really sure what to call it, but this is number three. I feel like there's some kind of tragic... What's, what's the word? Coincidence? It's not really a coincidence, is it? It's more of a pattern. And, yeah. Anyhow, let's take it out. Let's kill it. Okay. This is Uriel or something. It's 26,000 health. Very weak to physical attacks. Very resistant to fire, water, and wind. Which means, Edna, you're the bay. Wait, this isn't Steno? Nope, this ain't the same. It looks the same. But that's because they're really lazy. So, yeah, don't be silly. Can we keep going, team? No, oh, team, you lost the combo. We had such a nice combo going. And apparently, we screwed it up. Alright, here we go. Time to get a combo. I want the biggest combo possible so I can, like, one hit this thing. Come on now. Although, that being said, I'm pretty sure the best Mystic Art is the Wind one. I'm pretty sure that one is by far the most damaged, but I could be horribly mistaken. Anyway, combo time. Oh man, we lost the combo again. Come on. Team. Team, please. Let's get this combo going. No, stop letting it recover. And freaking combo it. Why? Oh, Lila got. Oh, we got petrified. We both got petrified. Alright, someone unpetrified me. Come on now. Let's, let's not be petrified any longer. Petrifying is rubbish. Come on. Alright, okay. I guess we have to armatize to be unpetrified. Fair enough. Yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not doing that again. No, don't heal Lila. Heal me. How do I change who I'm targeting? What? No! No, I don't want to target her! I want to target myself! That's better. How the heck? I don't understand. How do you choose your... How do you choose the target? That's super weird to me. Anyhow, we don't need to let her use the spell. I mean, she's not that strong. But unfortunately, we now use up all our SCs. We're not going to be able to kill her with the best of what I was hoping to do is get loads of the points for doing that. But, oh well. Oh, we're actually getting a lot, our combos are getting a lot higher now, so that's good. Does anyone want to, you know, pull out a Mystic Art? That would be good. Oh man, we're so close. Yes, we got enough! Alright. I think this should be enough to take it out, right? That didn't kill it! So right, your Mystic Art sucks, man. It does no damage. How do you get a better Mystic Art? It must be a thing. Oh man, that almost petrified us again. Okay, don't get hit by this, it will best fight you. Let's finish it off. Team, can we just finish it now? I mean, yeah, that's right, I'm a win team. There we go. Snake down. No! Kill it, quick. <laughs> I know now. I know how bottomless is human desire. Lila. Mm. You glorified me as a saint. You pushed all of it on me. You did nothing to help! You let disease take the children one by one! Ah, none of it! None of it was my fault! Careful, get back! And she exploded! She Casual. still had fight left in her? Dang it! We couldn't purify her either! Not doing so hot, are we? Hey, wasn't that Hellion? Yeah, it must have been the saint. Betrayed by the people she believed in. Medusa type Hellions tend to be women with high degrees of self righteousness and hatred. Oh, so that's why you freeze when they glare at you. The saint huh? was a nun. Maybe the church in Pendrago would have some info on her. Let's check it out. We can't have Hellions like that running wild. Interesting, interesting. And we actually got a. Well, it sounds like we got some kind of lead as to more of them. So I guess that's something we can definitely check out. But now we're on this side of the path. I guess we may as well... Well, there's this lovely ruin here. I'm not entirely sure what these ruins are exactly, but I figured we may as well get it marked on the map at the very least. So what is it? Arctus Ruins. And they have zombies inside. All right, zombie. It's actually a ghoul, apparently, and it has paralysis. Fan tabby dozy. All right. 
Ghouls are such a pain, even for zombie types. It's best to stay away if they're in a pack. But we can use focused attacks and physical ailments, right? Uh, but, you know, undead are weak to fire, right? Except they're totally not. They don't resist the demons, though. So. I guess in that sense it's alright. Yeah, don't let it eat you. You don't want to be eaten by zombies. Trust me, that's, that's something I've done before. Not something good. At all. So this place looks interesting. I don't really understand the need for these dungeons because they don't seem to have anything in them. We can, of course, jump through these gates if we want to. Not sure we really want to be exploring this particularly. Uh, I don't really see the need. Like I was saying. Oh, look at this. This is a cool room. You don't have the key. Why do I need a key? I don't know what's in there. Damn it. Damn it. I really want to know now, but I really don't want to go through this dungeon. So we're just going to leave. It's fairly easy to come back if we need to, so I think we'll be okay with that. I'm not really sure if these are kind of extra bits that you can explore for your own curiosity, or they're actually something more. I honestly don't really know. It's not spelled out to you. It's not really even suggested to you, so it's kind of a, a difficult one to prize together. But either way, we are going to Pendrago to check out the church. That would mean teleporting there. Oh, please tell me we can. I bet we can't. Alright, how close can we get? We can get to Logrin. Of course we can get to Logrin. We started there. So, that probably means we can teleport somewhere in the moor, right? Okay, so if we go to the bridge... What's the bridge called? I can't remember. I, what is the bridge called? Ah, bridge, what are you called? It's Great Camelot Bridge. Okay, so we can't teleport to the Great Camelot Bridge. Which means that's where we need to go. Zaf got more. Exit leading to the bridge. Thank you very much. This is the closest we can get to Bendrago. Fantabby Dozy. It actually sucks. It's so far away, and yet so close. Let's save quickly, just in case we get killed by any malicious monsters. Because they are around, that's for sure. We should definitely eat something as well. Top ourselves up on SP. Or anything that actually heals us, that restores everyone 20 SP. That it, strawberry tart is actually really good. Let's have a raspberry mousse. Yeah, raspberry mousse. Sounds delicious. I could do a raspberry mousse right now, but unfortunately it won't just teleport to me. Oh well, let's see what's next. So we're gonna run down here. Oh, there's actually a quest point on this bridge. Which will explain why we couldn't teleport over it. Huh. I wonder what it is. There's also a Norman? That's weird. I wonder what the quest point on the bridge is. Maybe Heldaf's just chilling out on the bridge and be like, Oh, hey buddy. What you doing here? Not what I was expecting at all. Oh, this black book actually ran me down. Alright, we know what to do. We know how to take care of blackbirds. Blackbirds get killed by work. It is really stupid to use a Mystic Guard on something that resists it, but there you go. I guess that's something you can do. And bam, we win. You're pretty strong, Zidi. Bam, we win. Yeah, Zidi's pretty damn good. He wasn't even in that battle, but he's still cool. Anyhow, let us leave. We're gonna run down here. These blackbirds are totally gonna ca actually won't catch me as long as I've got the sprint thingy on. But I'm not entirely sure. Oh, wait, we haven't used that save point. It must be where the giant squid was. Yeah, that kind of makes sense, I guess. Which probably explains how we missed the Norman, if there is one. Which, it. it I guess Ender's. Le Norman's psych ability has leveled up so far that she can now sense the Normans on the bridge. I'm not entirely sure, but. Seems that way. Oh my word, I didn't see that. Okay, I just walked straight into it. No, I don't want Mikio. Now they come off. Alright, screw you, Mikio. We don't want you. I was looking for Edna. Ow. Shall we uh, stop this thing casting a spell? That's a good plan. It really shouldn't be that strong anymore, so. What about you? What are you with you? Yeah, just kill them. So these are working uh, a pretty good way. I knew it. I remember you being weak to Earth. Alright, take him down the slow way. Alright, we got him. It looks like we do win, Saray. You're correct. Now we can run away at light speed. Um. So it looks like the Norman, I assume that's a Norman. It may very well not be, but I'm, I am assuming. Seems like a good assumption. Did you hear? Another war coming on. Yeah, looks like both Rollins and Highland are ready to take the kid gloves off. It's gonna get ugly. Yeah, 
And I hear it's all going down at Glavin Basin. This is too good. Damn straight, food and weapons. Medicine and coffins. We're gonna make a fortune. Another <laughs> war? <laughs> now these guys are this greedy, but I mean it's if true. Any malevolence collects. That's probably exactly what he wants. You mean held off, yeah? Oh, it's a turtle. Let's go take a look. Sounds like Alright! I finally found where he's located. Hey! Careful! You okay? Thank yous. I'm a bit weary from my journeys. But it's time to settle the scores. Gotta hurry to the cat's corner. Wait, there's cats in this game? Oh. The turtles. He's still hurt. He's going to Cat's Corner, huh? Is he going to have a duel there? It's the illusionary village where cats live. <laughs> it might become a huge cat and turtle free-for-all. So, I wonder, where exactly is this Cat's Corner? I've never heard of it before. I don't know much either. We're gonna have to do some research. Hey, can we not just follow the turtle? Let's start by asking Seraphim who are knowledgeable about regional lore. Good idea. Guardian Seraphim are more likely to know something about the lore or legends. Well, should we ask Gramps then? But the turtles. Wait, do you record that? No. No, she doesn't. She doesn't care. But the turtle. If the turtle is going there, we can literally just follow it. It wouldn't be that difficult. Can we teleport from here now? I, I'm betting not. Oh, we can. All right, in that case, take me straight there. I don't want to... Okay, actually, we're going to Pendragon. That's what we were going to do. Yeah, boy. I'm just... Actually, there was a Norman here, though, wasn't there? I don't know. I don't know if there was actually a Norman here or not. So I will check quickly by going in this map. Yeah, it doesn't look like there was. Or if there was... Maybe it was on the map before. Maybe it doesn't point you directly to it. It just says, yeah, there's one here. Find it. But I'm too lazy to do something like that, so... Oh, hang on, what? Norman for the win. All right, it's on this map, then. Where are you, Norman? Where? Oh wait, we already got it? Or... I mean, there is a shiny light here. Oh, maybe that's the Norman itself. Uh, where? where? In the box? It's in the box, of course it is. Pinion! Alright, what, what skills do you give? Capability versus winged foes. That's actually kind of useful. Let's just stick it on this weapons if we can. Thank you very much. It's useful mainly because... Oh, I made a new save. Whoopsie daisy. Anyhow, let's go to Pentrago first before anything else. And we will talk to the church. The church must have something to say, I right? They're evil. The preparations. Mikleo, we don't care. Go back to your hole. I'm very mean to Mikleo, but he deserves it, right? Stupid cape. Okay, anyway. Give me these weapons. Oh, I love all weapons. Why do they still spell, sell spears? I mean, you can't play as... Well, maybe you can later on, I don't know, but... Considering we can't play as Alicia, it does seem a bit odd that they still give you those weapons. The spears, anyway. Maybe it's suggesting that she might come back. I don't think she does. It's a bit late in the game for her to just randomly turn up and be like, Yeah, I'll join your party again. You'll be like, oh. But you're level 10. And all my guys are like level 1 billion. Great. Anyway, here's the church. Is there any news of any kind? I was told to come here. I'm not sure you actually needed to come here, though. Well, if not, we could teleport away. That's not the biggest deal in the world, but... Oh, okay, there is something here. Good. Oh, we're gonna talk to all of you. Tell me. Tell me of your things. What? What? Oh, it's the bookshelf? All right. A pleasant, cheerful man. However, she... En None. Sorry, not a man. However, she engaged in relations with Father Eric and bore his illegitimate child. Both were in excommunicated from the church in Exgal to Horsa Village, on the edge of Zafgot Moor. Oh. Zoldin Fortin, the middle Fortin sister, a nun with great compassion and sense of service. Some of the faithful refer to her as a saint. She approved of the land reclamation, uh, reclamation project in Plittsburg Wetland, relocated there with a group of believers. For details of the land re relocation project, reclamation projects, Please refer to another resource. And Runette Fortin, the youngest of the Fortin sisters. 
An eloquent nun, rich in knowledge, made her name as a reformer in church politics and financial affairs. Following the disappearance of Pope M Macedra, she demonstrated a number of miracles leading to her election as cardinal. Note, the hometown of the Forton sisters is the village of Forton, located beyond Graven Basin. The village is one of extreme poverty and is suspected that the sisters were strongly pressured to take their vows in order to reduce the number of mouths to feed. I can't believe it. Both of the Medusa type hellions are. You know, three, right? They're probably Cardinal Fortin's sisters. Are you sure? It seems like too much of a coincidence. Well, the only way to learn the truth is to ask the hellions themselves. But how? If we're right, then I'm guessing they've gone back to their hometown. A gut feeling? Sort of, yeah. Just a hunch based on how humans think. Well, it's not impossible, psychologically speaking. <laughs> Halfway logic is better than no logic at all. And Rose's gut hasn't led us astray yet. But we can't go there right now. Glavin Basin is currently closed off. So, we'll have to sit tight and wait for an opportunity, huh? Interesting, interesting, but there's still books to read here, apparently. No, we've already read this, we don't need to read it again. No! Damn you and your reading! Yeah, we, we, why are they still question exclamation marks there? That's kind of annoying. What do you have to say? The personal histories of the priests and nuns of the church are elated by your interest. The records are all archived on the bookshelf. You're welcome to browse them anytime. I myself have spent many a candlelit evening lost in the limitless wonders. That's great, dude. That's really weird, though. Right, so now if we read it, will it unmark it? Because that would be nice. Nope, it didn't unmark it. Alright, then. Whatever. At least we've read it. I'm pretty sure we triggered the event if we need to. So we can get out of here. We can skedaddle down. And we can do great things. Anyhow, we're going to kick our ass down there. So I guess now the thing to do would be to... Well, I don't really know. Well, I, I, yeah, I guess we we'll are go to Glavin Basin. It looks like everything kind of is accumulating around there, so... It's time to end the war again by fighting in it? Maybe if we fight on the other side this time, it'll be fair. We'll be like, yeah! No! Yeah! Maybe we see Alicia and our friend... Miss... Why, well, I can't even remember his name. Anyhow, let us... What is his name? Sergey. That's his name. Sergey. I wonder if Sergey's fighting. He didn't fight last time, did he? I can't remember. Anyhow, Glaveland Basin. Oh. Disappointing. Let's go next to Glaveland Basin. Then. Let's bring it on, Basin. Alright, turn around and walk down here. There we go. The Basin is smoking. Literally smoking. Not so great, I guess. But there is a battle going. I mean, this whole thing has been a battlefield the entire time. It hasn't changed at all. Is that a Seraph? Interesting. What are you doing watching over the battlefield, Seraphin? Interesting indeed. Who are you? Ah, oh, my love. He is kidnapped. Kidnapped by a Hellion with the face of a lion. Oh, that's not good at all. In fact, that giant knight down there doesn't look good at all either. So, is that the person from the hunting ground before? Would you it like may that? well be. The ones that were like, oh, all I want to do is stay here forever. I'm not sure. Anyhow, will these guys let me through now there's a war on? I hope so. Always we have to teleport over them. Which is probably a doable thing, but there you go. Reporting casualties for the Blue Tempest Knights. 118 wounded, 30 dead. Be careful. There's Report. A approximately 50 casualties on the enemy side. <sighs> Sounds like Maltron's is it around over there. already? Don't kid yourself. It's no more than a skirmish along the front lines. If both armies were clashing full on, the body count wouldn't be anywhere near this low. This low? Where are the Platinum Knights? Sir, they're still struggling to evacuate Lastenbell. Can't they see there's no time? Saray, there's no point in just staying here. The Platinum Knights are in Lastenbell. Let's go see Sergei. Yeah. Are you freaking serious? Wow! I swear this place is just a dead end every single time. They're like, yeah, you gotta come back to the Glavelin Basin, do something. It's like, nope. Glavelin Basin sucks balls. 
No thing ever goes down there. They're just having a war all the time. And it's like, oh, oh, lovely kitty slap. Uh, uh. And then, oh, oh, 30 are dead. Great. 30 random people. That's what happens in wars. And for some reason, Mr. What is his name? I can't even remember his name. What is the main... What? Oh, this guy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What happened? Boss. Talfrin, what happened? We were all... <laughs> Captured in Pendrago. They said we murdered the Cardinal. At the behest of the Kingdom of Highland. <laughs> what? But I was the one who... It was Lunar. He approached the Empire and suggested they frame it this way. Wait, what? Of course. The Empire oh, no. was just itching for a justification to launch a war. If they could tell the world that Highland had assassinated their Cardinal... Almost too perfect. Lunar laid an ambush for us. If Egil hadn't shielded me, I would have... I'm sorry. I couldn't do anything but run away. We knew this might happen sooner or later. Part of the job description. But still... Rose, you should go. But we have to stop the war! We all know what they'll do now that they've trumped up a justification. Dispose of the evidence. You can't leave them like that, can you? After all, they're your family. You said it yourself, didn't you? You and I have two very different jobs. Thank you. I'll be back. Wait, she's leaving? Smells like Alicia to me. What about us? Should we be rescuing the scattered bones or stopping this war? Both are vital, but we can't be in two places at once. But we can, Sergei's in Lastonbell. Alicia's probably at the Highland Army base. Then... Oh, we have to make a decision? If I remember correctly, wasn't there some kind of cave or something leading to Highland around here? Right, the Lamarack Cave. Wait, so do we have a decision or not? That's interesting. Ah, I want to go see Alicia though, because I want her to join my team. Especially since now we're kind of down a person, but... Can we actually go to Lastonbell? Is that something we can do? I don't want to go there, but I'm, I'm intrigued. Maybe this is so... Oh, I don't know. Ha! Huh. Very interesting. Well, I think we should go talk to Alicia first anyway. I, I mean, I want to go to Lastonbell because that's not the one I want to do. But at the same time, I don't want to come back and load the game necessarily. You know what? I reckon we should go to Lester. No, oh, I don't know. Uh, I guess we're working out some other time. Let's just go see Alicia. That's what they're suggesting for sure. So, Alicia, can we actually get to you easily? I don't know. So, where are we? We're in this forest at the moment. We want to go to the other side. In front of the bridge, in front of Maryland, in front of Eastern Shore. I don't know. Slogan Heights. I have not, neither of these mean anything to me. So let's go to this one. <laughs> I'm just going to guess randomly and see if this is anywhere near Glaven Basin. It probably isn't. Oh, actually, I don't think I did too bad a job. Nice. Yeah, Glaven Basin is just down there. And the star is there as well. So, I wonder what would happen if we went to see Sergei instead. Also, has that mountain always been there? Because that is one gigantic mountain. Anyway, Alicia, join my team. I have loads of weapons for you. For some reason, we could only have about two humans on the team, but join me anyway. Join me, Alicia. We want you back. Come back to me, my babe. Although Edna's still the babe. You can be bay number two. Anyhow, hurry up and get your ass here. Where the heck is she? I swear there was a star on the map. Maybe there wasn't a star. I think I'm just going crazy. All right, then. Never mind. We're going to the Highland Army base. Hope we'll see if we can find our lovely Alicia. Quite possibly. Let me in. Prepare oh, it's Maltran. Maltran, no. Once we receive the royal order, our entire forces will destroy the Roland's army. Go do it, Maltran. I'll kill you. I'll do it. Yeah. Oh no. Okay, not allowed. Maltran. My, my shepherd, Saray. Welcome to our base. Perfect. We are moments from receiving the royal order authorizing our assault. And the messenger will be an old friend of yours. You can't mean... You're making Alicia do that? <laughs> it's cruel of Bartlow, but still an ingenious plan. 
If she brings the order, the war is on. And should she refuse, he can have her court-martialed for treason. I can only imagine her dismay. You disgust me. Will you attack me? Please, be my guest. Then I could reasonably claim that spies from Roland's were in our camp. No need to wait for a royal order. <sighs> Looks like the odds are stacked against us. We're going to need Alicia's help to hold back the army. Alicia, is it? Go ahead and try then. I'm very curious. Wait, so what? what's the goal then? What are we meant to do? Are we just... is that it? What? So we have to go find her or do we just leave? We're just like, we're done. As soon as the order arrives, we will commence the attack. If you wish to fight for Highland, we ask your patience, Shepard. Wow. I don't want to fight for you guys, but, you know, nice try. Nice try. Okay, so let's skedaddle out of here. Do we have to now try and intercept her? I, I don't really understand. Alicia wasn't at the army base. Let's check over at Lady Lake. But if we get Alicia involved, we'll have no choice but to tell her that Maltran is a Hellion. She'd be hurt for sure. I'm aware, but there's no other choice. It's very true, there is no other choice. Is this an invisible wall? What is this? Oh. Interesting. Okay, so what exactly is that? And why can't we go there? Hmm. Suspicious. That must actually be something, so that's kind of interesting. Alright, let's teleport away to Lady Aleku. Up here. Alright. I want to go to the sanctuary. Take me to the end. The end is much more interesting. Alright, quickly save this up. Alright. Alicia, we are looking for you. I actually don't know where she would be. That's the that's the next thing I'm not really sure about. Alicia, where art thou? What art thou doing? I guess she must be at her house. Because where else would she be? But I hope she joins my team again. Even if it's just for a little while, it'll be nice to see... I mean, we've got so many weapons for her. You've got... She's got to join the team, at least for a little bit, right? It'd be nice if she stayed forever, but I feel like that's not very likely. Which is unfortunate, because... She's interesting using a spear, but apparently it's not else. Anyhow, we got to tell her that Maltran is a Hellion, and we need to kill Maltran, because... It makes sense, somehow. Alicia! I'm here! Let's How make dare out. How you obstruct our glorious battle? You're a disgrace to Highland! What's gotten into you? Alicia! Right, just like that, we're just gonna run in and fight. Wait, what about Alicia? She not, she's not already my squire, she could join. Alright then, let's use this guy. Saray? We'll talk later. Are we good, Lila? Yes, I've reactivated the squire's friends. Oh, okay, so you have to reactivate it? Oh, she's back, alright, cool. Oh, she has a new weapon as well. No, oh, what the heck? We just swapped it to me. Nice to meet you. Right. That look in your eyes says you have a question. No, I think I'll focus on the battle for now. Wow. Whoa, okay, that was a big jump. Big ability. Alright, we got we got her back there. She joined the team. Alright, we killed those things. That's more or less what brought us here. I see. Wait, Zavid always talks about himself. <laughs> we'll fill her in later. Interesting, interesting. Why were those soldiers attacking you? Probably because I've been stalling the war. I have yet to deliver the royal order authorizing our attack. And they hate and resent you that much? You can see for yourself. There's not a thing in the world that can prevent this war now. You're giving up? What else can I do? What else do you expect me to do? The king has commanded that we launch an attack on Roland's. An official royal order has already been issued. If that dumb piece of paper is causing you all that grief, why don't you just chuck it? Just chuck it? What exactly do you mean by chuck it? Just what I said. Tear up the damn thing like it never existed. I can't! You can't expect Alicia to do something like that. Hey, no pressure. I don't mind seeing her beautiful face all scrunched up in pain. No. <sighs> I 
Wow, she's being a bit of a douchebag and muffin, isn't she? Just get on with it. Just order the war. You got nothing else to do. If you got nothing else to do, just do it. Saray, I think perhaps the only way to stop this war is to do as Zavid suggested. Would you be willing to assist me in this? Are you sure about this? You would be rebelling against your own country. I know the risks. All right. Well, if Alicia's made up her mind, we can't refuse her, can we? Zavid, may I trust you in this matter as well? I can't decline a heroic princess. Your face looks better with a smile on it anyway. One ray of hope is that Lady Maltran is the one commanding our army. She is bound to cooperate with us. What's wrong? I hate to tell you this, but Maltran's not gonna help you. She is a Hellion. Edna just spilled the beans. She serves the Lord of Calamity. She was the one pushing for war in the first place. Edna! We had to tell her at some point. Yeah, better she hear it now than get stabbed in the back later. That can't be true! Don't you even dare joke about such a thing! Alicia, please calm down. No, Lady Maltran. She always encouraged me, even when... <laughs> I apologize. I will see Lady Maltran and verify this for myself. Back to that scrunched up face of hers. Interesting, interesting. So is she in the team or not? Is she just going on ahead? Oh no, she is totally in the- 59! Oh, she's saying that was me. Alright then, cool. I guess she's been doing her training, doing her press-ups. I don't know. Anyhow, we will call it a day there. Thank you very much for joining me on this one. I will see you again next time. Till then! Good night!